I finished Johnny Story five years ago when my dad had a heart attack. Subscribe and hit the bell to follow me on my fitness journey. Five years ago, when my dad had a heart attack and passed away, the doctor came in and told me if I wanted this to be me to keep doing what I was doing, if not, I needed to work out and eat right. My sister and I knew that working out wasn't going to be easy being single moms, and we were going to need something to hold us accountable. So we signed up for a fitness competition. We really like working out, and we loved the changes our body was making. And our boys loved going to daycare at the gym. Right before my competition, Ben had a seizure in the daycare and needed rescue breaths, and we had to call 911 to transport him to Cook's. After that, the daycare gym was not an option for him to stay. We made it to our first competition with our dad in our heart and our boys beside us and our family supporting us. After our first competition, we had to take a break because there was no gym that would watch Ben and I wasn't willing to leave Ben so I could go work out. We knew it was time to start working out again. Gyms were still no option. So we started running. We downloaded the app, Couch to 5K. We ran our first two 5Ks pushing Ben in his wheelchair. It wasn't easy. My Twitter store found out that they make these running wheelchairs, and another friend actually gave us one. Running was going great. Our friends were running with us, and we were even meddling in our age group. Things couldn't have gone better. But then, progression of disease happened, and Ben was no longer able to sit in his chair while we run, and I ended up carrying him through a 5, a 10, and a 15K. It was time to take a break from running. But Ben had ran more races than most kids his age, and we had had a lot of fun doing it. I even got to meet my hero. After Ben's trichostomy, he became stable, and I knew it was time for us to hit the road again and start running. So we downloaded the app, Couch to 5K, and we're back at it.